Is it the right time to buy or sell Meta stock? In this video, we will be delving deep into Meta. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, December 8, 2023. Today, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. To stay updated on our latest analysis, make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell. By doing so, you won't miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of artificial intelligence and get free price predictions and deep analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since December 7, 2023, our system has identified Meta as a promising investment, giving it a score of 3.48. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has shown a gain of 1.89%. This means that on average, it has generated a daily return of 0.94% since being identified as a buy candidate. The stock we're looking at is currently in the middle of a strong and upward trend in the short term. This indicates that there could be further growth within this trend. Looking at the past three months, there's a potential 10.61% change expected over the next three months for this stock. This means that investors could see a return ranging from 1.13% to 15.45%. In terms of the 12-month trend, there's a projected 154.34% change over the next year. This suggests that the stock could potentially see a return between 140.93% and 181.82%. So, after a year, the price range could be anywhere from $801.69 to $937.74. Our latest update for Meta brings you this headline, Meta stock price up 1.89% on Friday. On Friday, the 8th of December 2023, the Meta stock price experienced a gain of 1.89%, climbing from $326.59 to $332.75. Throughout the day, the stock fluctuated by 3.14%, starting from a low of $323.01 and reaching a high of $333.17. In the past 10 days, the price has fallen in 7 instances, resulting in a decrease of 1.62%. On the last trading day, the volume dropped by 4 million shares, with a total of 12 million shares traded, amounting to approximately $3.86 billion. It is important to note that a decrease in volume alongside higher prices can indicate divergence and may serve as an early warning for possible changes in the coming days. Over the course of the previous 52 weeks, the highest price recorded for the stock was $342.92, while the lowest price was $112.46. Currently, the price is 2.97% lower than the 52-week high, equivalent to a difference of $10.17. Additionally, it is 13.42% lower than the all-time high reached on September 1, 2021, with a price of $384.33. Today, let's take a look at the analyst ratings for Meta, a company that has been generating a lot of buzz recently. On Monday, November 20, 2023, B. Riley Securities gave Meta a neutral grade with a hold action. This indicates that they believe the stock will perform in line with the market. Another analyst, Wedbush, gave Meta an outperform grade with a hold action on the same day. This suggests that they expect the stock to outperform the market. Wells Fargo also weighed in on Monday, November 20, 2023, giving Meta an equal weight grade with a hold action. This means that they believe the stock will perform in line with its industry peers. Let's rewind a bit to Thursday, October 26, 2023, when Goldman Sachs gave Meta a buy grade with a hold action. This indicates that they have a positive outlook on the stock and expect it to outperform. Lastly, KeyBank also chimed in on Thursday, October 26, 2023, giving Meta an overweight grade with a hold action. This suggests that they believe the stock is poised to outperform its industry peers. According to analysts, the overall rating for Meta stock is a buy. They have categorized the P-E ratio as a strong buy and the price-to-book ratio as strong buy. 
However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts have given the stock a rating of neutral. Today we're going to talk about the signals for Meta stock. The stock has been experiencing mixed signals lately. On Wednesday, November 22, 2023, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point, resulting in a fall of minus 2.56%. It is expected to continue falling until a new bottom pivot is found. Additionally, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. However, there are also positive signals for Meta stock. Both short and long-term moving averages suggest a buy signal, indicating a positive forecast. Moreover, the relation between the two signals shows that the short-term average is above the long-term average, further supporting a buy signal. In case of corrections downwards, there is support from the lines at $323.87 and $321.77. If the stock breaks below any of these levels, it will issue sell signals. It's worth noting that volume fell during the last trading day despite the stock's gain in prices. This creates a divergence between volume and price, which may serve as an early warning. So, it's important to closely monitor the stock's performance. Let's explore some other interesting signals. Moving average convergence divergence indicates a sell signal. Pivots show a sell signal 12 days ago. Bollinger provides a buy signal 18 days ago. The short-term moving average suggests a buy signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average also indicates a buy signal 3 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages suggests a buy signal 24 days ago. Now, let's take a look at the 12-month chart. The short moving average shows a buy signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average indicates a buy signal 30 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages suggests a buy signal 224 days ago. Make sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals. Here's what you need to know about support, risk, and stop loss for Meta. When it comes to support levels, the stock has a strong base just below today's level at $299.53 and $297.74 thanks to accumulated volume. It's important to be aware of the risk involved when a stock tests a support level. If this support level is broken, the stock may fall to the next support level. In this case, Meta has additional support just below today's level at $299.53. If that is broken, the next support levels from accumulated volume will be at $297.74 and $288.35. Meta is typically traded at a good volume, with minor daily price fluctuations, which lowers the overall risk. In the past day, the stock had a price range of $10.16, 3.14%, between its high and low points. Over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 2.49%. Before we discuss the potential trading levels for Meta, let's start by exploring some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This ratio is significant as it measures a company's current share price in relation to its per-share earnings. In the case of Meta, the P-E ratio appears to be within the normal range, which is commonly observed in businesses with established track records or consistent revenues. Moving on to other news, the upcoming earnings report for Q4 2023 is scheduled for February 07, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report stand at $4.75. It's crucial to keep a close watch on these figures, as they can significantly impact the stock prices. Today, we'll be analyzing some important day trading levels for Meta. In the case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Meta is at $334.19. If you're not already invested in this stock, it might be wise to wait for it to break through this level before considering a position. However, if you're already holding shares, this resistance could be a potential opportunity for swing trading. On the other hand, if Meta experiences a downward movement, it will encounter its first support level at $299.53. If the stock manages to hold this support level, it could serve as a promising entry point, indicating a possible rebound.
The combined average rating for Meta from multiple analyst sources is a buy. Now, let's take a closer look at some recent insider trades. On December 5, 2023, Jennifer Newsted sold 566 shares of Class A common stock. On December 6, 2023, Mark Zuckerberg sold 7,175 shares of Class B common stock. On December 6, 2023, Mark Zuckerberg sold 399 shares of Class A common stock. On December 6, 2023, Mark Zuckerberg sold 1,001 shares of Class A common stock. And on December 6, 2023, Mark Zuckerberg sold 1,099 shares of Class A common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power has been calculated to be negative with a ratio of minus 70.702. Overall, insiders purchased 28,700 shares and sold 169,311 shares in the last 100 trades. For this stock, we recommend setting the stop loss at $319.44, which represents a decrease of 4%. This ensures a lower risk investment. It's important to note that this stock experiences minimal daily fluctuations, further reducing the risk involved. Additionally, we have detected a sell signal from a pivot top that occurred 11 days ago. Is Meta stock a good investment? Based on several short term signals and a positive overall trend, we believe that the current level may present a buying opportunity for Meta stock with a fair chance of performing well in the short term. Upon analyzing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Monday, December 11th, we anticipate Meta stock to open with a decline of $3.11 and start trading at $329.64. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading involves a high risk of losing money. It's always a good idea to consult with a financial advisor before making any buying or selling decisions. At StockInvest.us, we provide valuable information for investors. However, it's crucial to note that our content should not be the sole basis for your investment decisions. By using the information we provide, you agree to take full responsibility for your own investment choices. We are not liable for any losses or gains resulting from your actions. Welcome to Stock Invest. In this video, we'll be discussing our current view on a particular stock. We value your opinion, so make sure to comment below and share your thoughts. We're also curious about your target for this stock. Let's engage in a meaningful discussion. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. We're here to provide valuable insights for your trading journey. Wishing you successful trading and a beautiful day from all of us at Stock Invest.